What's the crack? What's the bleeding story? How you all doing? Hope you're doing well. Um, Mikhail had his uh, press conference today, and Jesus Christ, the, it, it, the fans I blame. Fair play to uh, Arteta. He's, he's he's robbing the living. He's pulling the wool over a lot of fucking ages of eyes. I'll tell you that for one thing, because look, we all heard the press conference. I'm not even going to go into that. That that that's expected, you know. Um, I've been saying it here so many fucking times now with the journals. They're not going to ask him questions. There was probably one question that was a bit tricky and he didn't even answer it. He just skipped by it like a politician. He's good at his job in that way. He can skip around questions. He dodges the bullets. Big up to him. Fair play to him. As, like, you know, a lot of managers get themselves in deep water and stuff like that and can't come out of it. He doesn't. He's very good at it. Very, very good at it. You know, um, the the questions then the journals were asking, like most of them, usual shite, you know, bullshit. And like, you know, they'd ask him a question and he tried to elaborate on it. No, the cheek of him, the cheek of him to actually turn around and says he was the solution. You know, he, he's ticks, like, you know, he, the, the, the cheek of him to do that. But he's getting away with it. Fair play to him. I don't mind a, a wheeler dealer. They don't call me Del Boy for nothing. You know what I mean. So I, I can't. I can't diss him. I can't say anything like that to him. You know. So look, he's he's getting away with it. And you know, there's fans out there that are lapping it up, and you know they're they're taking it. And fair enough if that's what they think. You know, I certainly don't. And there's a lot of people like me that think this this system is an absolute joke. The manager's a joke. Edu's a joke, Vinoy's a joke, the, the, the whole club, the Cronkays running it as a joke, they're making money because there's fools out there buying stuff, you know what I mean, fools out there buying the 5th, 6th fucking kit that they're bleeding releasing, training top, about 10 fucking thousand have been fucking um, released this season, and where are we, you know what I mean, we're, we're out of every competition, you know, no cup competition, nothing. We're not in it. 17 games left in the Premiership. And we're finishing top four. I highly doubt it. I'm just looking here then at the comments on Arsenal.com, the, the, their YouTube channel, right? And the comments, you could not make this up. Like, I, I'm just going to read a few of them out. And I'm not going to name names. I won't name names or whatever, like, you know. So here's the force one I'm looking at, right? This is what this spell is saying. This guy is more than just a manager. Despite the jealousy and envy directed towards him, he never gave up, ignored the noise paid to him, no attention and focus. We can all learn from that. What? what, what, what what's this guy talking about? Like, And there's 23 likes on it. Like, so... 23 other people actually agree with this fella. Yeah, like... What? D d he's more than just a manager. He's not even a fucking manager. Here's another one. I'm fully behind Arteta. Yeah, he's still a young manager and has a lot to learn. And as much as I love Abu, let us not forget, nobody, no fucking body is important than the club. I'm just looking at his picture. He just looks like a fucking... Re I, I won't say. My God. Like, really? Here's another one. No, I, I, I haven't skipped one yet. I haven't skipped one. I'm just flicking down through them all here. Love this guy. Very intelligent young manager. I really love... I really hope in the future this team reflects his character. Oh, my God. 30 feet, 35 people like that as well. This is what we're dealing with here. It's it's it, th these are getting away with it in the club. Fair play to them. They're getting away with it because there's fucking agents, clowns out there that are lapping it up and accepting this shite. Jesus Christ, Mister Mikel Arteta, a professional and good communicator as always. My manager. Oh my God, really? Seventeen people like that. Really, really, like, is this a, this must be someone winding me up, because this is just, oh my god, hope, hope to see Pepe starting games, 
yeah, obviously. You know what I mean? He he will be because when we get injured, we're 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 very bare. We're like eighteen players in the squad, and three of them are are, are, are goalies. Fifteen outfield players. Trust me, you'll see Pepe, all right, and I won't be true. Uh, Arteta wanting to play him. It'll be true. We'll have no bleeding choice. He says we play three games out of five with ten men. Something to do with the discipline of the squad. There you are. Yeah, someone probably called them out there. Fair enough. And there's only five people that sort of like that. Well, there you are. I give it a like. There's six people. You know what I mean? He, he, he Like, you're disciplined. You, you should be able to discipline your squad. You know what I mean? He, he's not able to do that. Just seems to be players just going around. Like, you know, getting red cards here, there and everywhere. Um, Let me see. Like there's just some of these that I, I can't even read out because I'm just gonna actually I'll get this sp uh, video barred from YouTube. Oh my God, Mikel Arteta is great op opinion. He gives us I hope this young manager. So he gives us hope this young manager. Oh Jesus Christ! If we here's geez, there's one comment that's actually. Here it is. Why are fans so positive? If we lose Laka, we are done for. Fair play, mate. There's another light for you. You can question his tactics, but his press conferences are always on point. Twelve people like that. Really? Like, I suppose, yeah, look, I, I, I can't disagree with that because he's a politician. He's getting away with this, you know. He, he's he, These fools, like, they're, they're fools. They're not even Arsenal deluded fans. They're actually fools. You know what I mean? That, that are... And the reason why I'm saying this is because, like, we were on an invincible team, and ever since then, look at the state of us. You know, the Invincibles in their prime. What would the result be if the best of our team today, let's say, pick your best eleven, versus the Invincible best eleven? Not even the Invincible. Go back to '98 when we won the double. That team. They would annihilate them. I'd say they'd make such a show of them. If you and, and have Arteta managing the team as well. Do you know what I mean? Against Wenger's '98 team. Like and these fools are, 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 are like, oh my god, he's brilliant, and no, he's not. You know what I mean? Jesus Christ. Oh, here we go. A lot of fans don't understand how young Arteta is and how good his football knowledge is. He is only going to get better from here. 14 likes. Like the, 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 the ones that have, let's say, the negative, and there's not many of them, they've only one or two likes. Whereas the, the, these ones, I'll read this again, a lot of fans don't understand how young Arteta is. I do. He, he, what is he, 40, 41, 42? And how good his football knowledge is. He is only going to get better. Fourth season eight, second season eight. Oh, we're not finishing in the top four. You know, I'm lost here. Like I really am lost. I, this is, I probably shouldn't have even done this video. This is just winding me right up. And I just want to show show to you people that this is going on. Like, and you may be listening to the likes of me, to True Gunner, to Northside, to Lee. To Big Josh, to like you know, Gracie, you know, the, the, there's so many of us out there like that are sort of not on this side of the fence, you know. And you're probably saying, "Geez, it's nearly the same old story, same old story." But th this is what the other side of it is. Like these are settling for the, the mediocre. Like oh, fourth is a trophy, you know what I mean? They're settling for that. Me, and I'm sure everyone that I've just named there, want to win titles. I want to win a title. I want to win a league. That's my number one goal for Arsenal, is to win the league. And then we can start looking into the Champions League. You know what I mean? They're the two big things you want to win. If you don't be winning then, you're not a big club. And don't start this shite of going on about, Oh, London is red. It's fucking not. At the minute, it's blue. Because Chelsea are bleeding, running amok. They, they, I think they won today and all. They're, they're overplaying in the World Club Championship. Cup, whatever you want to call it.
that's what they're doing. You know what I mean? I we're we're sitting here reading this shit from clowns that are accepting all this. Oh man, this is just. I'm only going to read out one or two more because my blood is just boiling. You know what I mean? Here, like. Arsenal have a very good chance of finishing top four. No cups or Europe. Like, as a football team, do you not want to be in these competitions? Do you not want to be going far? Do you not want to be going far in the cup? Do you not want to win the cup? Do you want to be in Europe? Let's go and win something in Europe. Like, but this fella here is saying, yay, we're not in it. So let's go for top four. So you're settling for fourth. So when you were younger, mate, and I'm not even going to say his name, but when he was younger, if he was in, we'd say, a running race, and there was 10 people in it, did he want to come forward in that race? Because I know when I was a kid, if there was 10 people in a race, I wanted to win it. You know? But this guy is like, oh, I have an advantage here. Everyone's in bare feet. I have a pair of runners on. What the fuck, like? Uh, by the way, mate, the, the whistle is gone. Like, you know, they're halfway down the track. You're still scratching your fucking arse. Bleeding dope. Can you compare Eddie and Ab Abamyang? I hope in the next three games you will get a positive result. If not, you will regret why Abamyang left for free. Agree with that. No problem there. Um. Yeah, look, it just goes on and on. Like, you know, I'm not even going to, like, ruin... Uh, look, I probably have ruined your bleeding, your, your night, you know, but this is what we're dealing with. You know what I mean? You can see the comments yourselves, and it's just fucking so annoying. You know, like, we're going for top four, and that point that the fella made just there, yeah, we're not in Europe, and I'm so annoyed we're not in uh, the cup competitions. I'm so annoyed at that, you know? But these clowns are there. Oh, let's push for top four. I bet you if you asked him at the start of the year, what did he want? Oh, I'd love to get in the top four and maybe go on a cup run. I wanted to win the league. You know what I mean? I knew we weren't going to win the league, but I wanted to win the league. You know? This is what you're dealing with, people. You know, and, and, and people like myself and, and the others that I named there, we're always like, you know, negative and moaning and stuff like that. Yeah, we are, because look at the shite we're in. You know what I mean? Just, well, I, I think as you, if you agree with what I'm saying here, the only thing you need to do is support them channels that I'm saying. Subscribe, like, you know what I mean? Share the content, hit the notifications, you know what I mean? And and, and, and don't be starting buying all the merchandise. Because this is keeping this, these, this regime in the bleeding club. You know what I mean? These are fools. They haven't a clue. Half of them are probably living in their bleeding ma's fucking box room. You know what I mean? Load of tissue beside the bed. That's what they're doing. You know what I mean? They're they're not wanting to win. You know what I mean? It's it's just look. It's annoyed me. I'm after getting annoyed, and I didn't even want it. Like you know what I mean? I wanted to try and be positive, no coursing, and I'm I'm I'd be there in my head when I start these things. Right? Don't be saying bad words. It's like, it, it's making you look bad. But Jesus, every time I talk about Arsenal, I'm not usually like this. I'm I'm usually a happy go lucky person. Like you know what I mean? Some people that are watching this that know me probably say, no, he's not. But anyway, look, I'll leave it there. I'm going to uh, be on uh, Northside's um, channel tomorrow. We're doing a watch along. So please drop by, say hello, have the crack. We'll be watching the game. You know, I'm, I'm sure there'll be a few uh, few bad languages spoken, not just by me, you know. But uh, yeah, look, it, it's going to be interesting. Thanks a million for tuning in. Hit the like button if you like it. If you're not subscribed, smash the button please and help me grow my channel. Thanks a million. Arteta out.